All right, we are back for more Death Must Die, and we are finally in difficulty 30. Is it Darkness 30? And we are going to be doing a build that has basically been getting me wins and has carried me all the way until difficulty 30 and it is the most fun i've had with the game honestly the game has been slow i mean well let's just say i'm having a lot more fun with it since discovering this build so we are gonna go with maris here and and we are doing the sign of the time space wherein we have infinite pull range infinite magnet range but we get minus one dash and negative 30 percent no 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 faster dash cooldowns right yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's faster dash cooldowns okay now this is what makes it interesting the gear i have on her and i just picked up these sandals which gives us movement speed but gives us plus one dash charge and gets us back down to zero dash cooldowns so it pretty much negates the negative of getting this sign for maris and then oh man i have still have this what is this mask okay a bit more life a bit more expert offers Oh, yes. And I have her stacked with chance to heal one life on hit. So we have 6% from this. That's 13% now with a tusk. Um, 20% total now with a stick. What else? What else? What else? I think that's going to be it. 20% chance to heal on hit. I also have her stacked with XP gain because we're going to be doing the whole charred pole area thing, right? So... Almost 30% from the garment over here. 12% from this jewel. 0.9 passive XP gain from the belt. And I think that's gonna be it. Yeah. This sucks. I don't... My headgear sucks for Maris, though. Oh, well. I guess we'll find something better for her in the run. So, let's go in. It's gonna be my first try at difficulty 30. I have no idea whatsoever how this is going to go or if my build, the build that I have in mind, is even going to hold up with this difficulty. But I guess we shall find out. As you can see, wow, and everyone is super fast, huh? It is? There okay. Many paths forward. I was just going to say, it's going to be very dependent on time and... These are two things that I want right now, although they're both novice. I want warp strike, but the biggest thing is gem high. Whenever we take an XP shard, we gain movement, attack, and skill speeds for a split second. Yes, that is the first thing we want. And I hope we get time again right away and that we get... Wow, everyone is just... Wow, wow, everyone is fast, huh? Okay, got it, got it, got it. That's what difficulty 30 is all about. Okay, so... Difficulty 30 is Darkness 30. It's a completely different beast than what I've been used to. So, um, still staying with the same build, though. Same loadout. Um, all skills are uh, minus 540 pull area. Wait a second. Let me try this. Minus 50 pull area? Oh, let's just see what's going to happen. I think it's still going to be the same thing. Oh, and we got time right away. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, there's gem strike. I, all, I mean, gem high. I also want warp strike. But gem high is the prerequisite for this build. Still the same... Uh, going for the same build. Same loadout here. Okay, at least we got early good shrines here my shrines on my first attempt was pretty rough uh 20 damage against enemies above 50 percent life um more master offers let's go let's try to go for legendaries 10 percent. okay still not the worst with um adept and expert okay 10 percent master offers okay we'll take that okay lady justice okay okay We'll take Celestial Wings here. Celestial Wings synergizes well with the whole um, gem high thing. Just makes us move even uh, much faster, much crazier. Uh, okay. Honestly, well, I guess that's what the difficulty is all about, right? I was going to say, honestly, I'm just so bad at dodging. Oh, nice. We got an expert warp strike. So... 9% more damage. Three bounces. Go. Take it. 
One thing that I keep wondering about is if I'm gonna take force from time as well with this whole whole area thing. Gremlin root house. Dash cooldown, max life. You know, give me max life. I am you have 95 max life. Okay. Okay, this is a complete opposite from my first attempt. What is it? Lee Gong. Mm. Can you help? No, you can't. <laughs> yes! Ooh, we actually got more! Okay, let's go, Soul Stealers. Okay. So I got the three gods that I was going for. Time, uh, Mord, and then Lady Justice. Lady Justice was a... Um, was not a must. I was going for... Uh, a backup for, it, for her would have been Winter. Which now I'm wondering if I prefer more than Winter. Eh, we'll see. Okay, gem high into Adept. Yes. Nice. We got a huge jump in Warp Strike. But give me Adept gem high first. Probably put in... Probably skipping all the explanations for this build, huh? I'll, prob I'll probably put it in. Like highlights of it at the start of the video here because I just realized now that I'm not explaining what I'm doing the here assuming that I already talked about it nice expert ooh celestial wings at that but give me divine shield expert okay here's the thing we are getting some good upgrades and some good shrines here early as opposed to my first attempt wherein I drew vampirism like in the first two minutes or something but then I, all the shrines I was getting was um pretty doo doo. More adept offers, more heals. Give me more adept offers. Warp strike. Yeah, force. Your experience pull area is increased whenever you pull an experience shard through an enemy, it takes damage based on the XP shard. Um wondering about this. If the damage it does is worth it. Hmm. I'll probably wait for a non-novice one, for a higher level one. I'll go expert. I mean, I'll go upgrade Bard Strike here, because um, I want our attack to be the primary thing here. I mean, not necessarily the primary thing, I guess, but... Test Virtues. Your heart is corrupt. I still don't know what that does. Ooh, dodge that. Ooh, we have Divine Shield already. I'm mixing up my runs here. Just came off a loss. My first try at Darkness 30. It's doing some really bad dodging. But yeah, I was saying that I got vampirism very early. But then afterwards all the shrines were bad. The upgrades were bad. I don't know if that's how the game really does it. Okay, I'll take force. We get adept now. What about alteration ritual? I'll get force. It's just, if anything, it's just an extra form of damage. More ward strike. 1460, better damage for this one. Give me more. 26% more damage already for our attack. That is huge. That is huge. We haven't been getting more upgrades though. We still don't have a dash, I believe. We don't have a dash, right? We're still firing fire arrows at me we're gliding now we're gliding okay we need to keep on getting more stuff here more shrines that's what's gonna carry us here we understand. aside from the gem high of course more ward strike more force the summoner this is a tricky one for me it increases the damage of our summons permanently i am planning on getting necromancy eventually but what about soul stealers I mean, Ravens, yes, but Soul Stealers does not have damage, right? It has the uh, the life percentage thing. So, is that affected? Part of me wants to get this just so, I mean, 60 seconds is going to pass regardless. So, getting 8%, I'm going to take it. I just answered my own question. I'm not sure how good that will be. I've noticed, though, I think I want Necromancy more for like the end game with dracula just so we can get more 
um damage on him like kind of gang up on him but i've noticed that when you do have a quick build like this i mean it doesn't look like it right now but when you get gem high going right we do, we're gonna be moving pretty fast and enemies are moving super fast as well i've noticed that necromancy oh, so quickly um becomes irrelevant if that makes sense um i do want ravens it's an adept one because i do want mayhem that's right we need mayhem i don't i don't just want mayhem we need mayhem holy crap we got vampirism again okay let's go okay interesting well we did get the uh 10 more um master offers right is this here this site it's not where is it oh it's a grave okay oh you guys are still alive we need mayhem though nice reroll right there for vampirism though so we got an early good divine shield ow now i'm playing um overconfident um because i have vampirism but that's a bad thing um what about luck a multiplier for chance based god blessings i I'm gonna take this. Okay, I'm gonna take it. We have all the XP gain in the world. Might as well, right? Take all the stuff that can possibly get us a win. Keep losing my train of thought here. I feel like I have a bunch of unfinished thoughts here that I've been sharing. Holy crap. Max life loss per second. Enemies age, 6%. Okay. 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 <laughs> okay. Oh, gosh. So this is what difficulty 30 is, huh? I mean, I'll, uh, no, it's not difficulty 30. It's the master offers the 10%. So I got that from the Oni shrine, right? That is huge, man. We need mayhem. We need mayhem. Need to reroll for mayhem. Need something that will increase our damage. Oh. What's that other thing on my backpack? I don't know. Need to keep getting shrines here. I want the fates as well. I want the uh, shrine splinter thing. Protection, reprisal. Hmm. Maybe I get armor. I mean, 45 armor is no joke. I want reprisal for extra damage, but I did get force instead. Give me protection. Give me protection. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I had a pretty good run on my first attempt going, but so bad at dodging that I think I need all the defense I can get. This is the well up here, right? Yeah. Man, so nice to have movement speed for a change. Yes, trying to crom. Execution. Master Necromancy. We still need Mayhem. But to give me a Master Necromancy. At least it starts with good movement speed. Um, Yeah. Get it. Plenty attack area. Spell area. I'm gonna go spell area here. For the Soul Stealers. And hopefully eventually the Ravens. Level 15. Okay. We got a good start. Good attack damage right away. I get now why, why I was... um falling behind too much on that first run i'll probably yeah put it put in highlights of that run here so that you guys know what i'm talking about what does that do oh we have a thing it's a temporary boon gotcha it is not for okay lady justice are you gonna give me a uh <laughs> what is it um a master as well i mean a legend as well um I still read this as 30% less damage, right? So as much as I want to keep upgrading the Vine Shield, which we will do. I'm going to take this. Lots of defense so far. It's mayhem. We need mayhem. We need mayhem. Ooh, who is this dude again? The rogue. Dash cooldown evasion. Give me dash cooldown. 7.5%. Yeah, I don't think I have evasion anyway. Yeah, 0%. Yeah, so getting a bit more doesn't really make sense. Okay, no more shrines. The, okay, this is definitely getting us off to a better start. 
and still got us vampirism. Ooh, what is this dragon trying to do again? Movement speed. Oh, now they're piling on evasion. Give me... I'll still take the movement speed. For when gem high is turned off. That makes sense. Divine shield, yeah. Okay, we really need mayhem though for damage. As, as good as the uh, our main attack is right now. Yes, forge for attack damage. Perfect. Yes. Oh man, I fought these two. Um, what am I talking about here? I fought these two with only one dash at difficulty twenty, and I swear it was like it was horrible. Basically, it was. They're like the the first bosses, right? And they were the ones I feared the most for the whole run. Aside from Dracula, of course. Which was funny. Especially early. When we're still not strong enough, they are a problem. If you only have one dash. And gem high is not turned on, that's what I mean. I hope the... Uh, Force is doing some damage right now. Okay, we need uh, mayhem here. Oh, I want ravens, but I need mayhem. Now. Now. Oh, gosh. Maybe because I took serendipity. Um. One more. Oh, gosh. Okay, that was horrible. And if I am now fates... Give me rerolls, alterations. Um, what else? Splinter. Ooh, someone popped our shield. Oh, one is down. Okay. Oh, we got Mayhem Master! Yes! Oh, gosh. Okay. I gotta win this run, man. I gotta win this run now. Can't be not winning this run now. Good divine shield, good damage. Now we have mayhem. Now, and now we're ready to take um. What is it? Concentration, inner peace. Uh, this is. Does this affect um the life steal, the vampirism raid? I guess it does, right? If so, I'll take this over inner peace. Where's the Baron? Okay, there he is. Street what? Yo, oh, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. And it sucks. Oh gosh. Um. Ooh! I wanted Splinter, right? From these guys. That's the only thing I actually want from these guys, I think. If I'm not forgetting something. Um, dash has become longer. Evasion is increased. Man, I wish not. I took some evasion. Attack hits a wider area. Not really. Not really. Dash becomes longer. Over evasion. You know what? I'll take some evasion. Maybe... Oh. You never know. Can end up saving us. But that's what? Like... 30 oh, 13%. Okay, that's not too bad. I thought it would be like under... Um... Where is this thing? Oh, it's a well. Okay. I thought it would be like under 10%. How much was that anyway? 23? Okay. I get it now. Need to visit more shrines. Chest. Anything interesting here? I don't know. Serendipity. Ravens is here. I think Serendipity will be good, right? Good investment. Yeah, let's get that. More attack damage. Good. We got one forge already. Pickups. Yes. Only 9%. What? Keep following me, everyone. Now we're slowed down. 100% more damage. Where are my shrines? Here we go. Gold. Time field. Duration. Durations for... We do have Necromancy, right? 
We have necromancy. I'll take it. We have necromancy and we also have mayhem, gem high. I'm thinking about something else. The summoner. Okay. But we do have necromancy, right? Okay, good. This this thing, I know I like this. I know I like this. XP per second or enemy barriers are reduced. Give me more XP. Just pile it on. Keep piling it on. 100% more damage. Good. Go, go, go. Find more stuff. Maris. Gosh, we're out of gems. Shards. I mean, I hate it when that happens. Oh, but she's dead already. <laughs> wow. How'd that happen? More warp strike. Yes. Uh, fours, I'll probably prioritize last. 11.2 damage, but that's a lot of 11.2s coming through you, but warp strike first. Still haven't gotten splinter. Okay, more gold. What is our damage now anyway? 256. 266. Okay. More. More. Curse everyone. Come on. Where's everyone? You have it. Yes, sir. Uh, force. Is alteration ritual good? I think it's good. I just don't know how to use it. But I'll get force here. We're missing a few shrines here that I'm... Okay, with max life, XP gain, yes. Um, this is what we're missing. The, um... The library. And then there's the, uh... I don't know, something about the spell, the con, or... <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about, duration, go. I don't like how we're not seeing soul stealers firing more often. Did I mention that stealing? That sounds good. Stealing runestone of vigor. Green parrot. 9% chance. And more pickup drops. Ooh, where is this? Ooh, yeah. Give me that. We're done with alterations anyway. Give me a green parrot. Give me 2% more chance to heal on hit. And give me 60% pickup drops and 21 life. Oh, yeah. Give me, give me, give me. Oh gosh, we gotta win this run now, man. I bet Dracula's gonna poop on us. Like, we all OP. Oh shoot. And then just die with Dracula. Warp Strike, yes. 42% now, good. I wanna get that up to a minimum of 50%. Or life. What's our life now? 122. I like that. We need another one of, um, a forge again. Sure, more luck. But a forge... Um, what else? I think Krom's statue or something. Sickles of Mort. Oh, yes, this is why we're taking so long with Soul Stealers. It's not upgraded. We also need Ravens for more Mayhem stuff. 147. Wait, what? Wait, 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 what? How come attack damage is back down to a plus 141? Wait, what? Didn't we have like 200 plus already a while ago? What did I do? Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I get it. It's from a buff. Okay, temporary buff. Okay, okay, okay. Life. On me, okay. Oh, shoot. Why did I take that? We've stopped upgrading the shield. We need more of that. Sickles of Mort. Soul Stealers. Whenever you kill an enemy, there is a chance it spawns a weak XP shard. Nah. Nah. Could actually be good. They deal damage equal to a percentage of your attack damage and apply your attack statuses, which is nothing, right? We don't have attack statuses, or do we? I don't think we do. I don't know, but give me more soul stealers, that's for sure. Oh, shoot. This, what, what, what? This should be like an easy phase right now. This should be to our favor. 
More damage. What is up with that? More XP, yes. Gimme, give gimme. Give Why are you slowing down? Ooh. Did I take reprisal? Any protection. Well. Oh my gosh. When did I give up my armor? Mother of freak. Vampirism. I'm so stupid. Ah, that is super stupid of me. What a waste of two upgrades now. Freak. Oh. I'm annoyed at myself right now. Completely lost track of it. Pop their shield again. Infinity. <sighs> Maybe I should take more force. More duration. Maybe I should take more force, huh? Ooh, a bunch of uh, master level stuff. A 150 evasion. Fun. Ah, I'm still not over it. Ooh. The, uh... Look at the parrot go. Kill that thing. Man, where are all the enemies? Here we go. We're missing this one as well. What do I want from this? More max life. Yeah, I'll take it over cooldown. Ah, so stupid with the, um... I hate it. Still not over it. Here we go. This is what we're missing. Sacred Tome. Well, it's more adept offers and more heals. Give me more heals from vampirism. I'm hoping it affects vampirism. Okay, I'm looking at this and I want more force now. Yes, yeah, smart. Get in here. Necromancy. Yes. Soul stealers. More soul stealers. Okay, 193% more damage. Oh, we missed something here. Level 28 at 13 minutes. I don't know how to feel about that. So in my... Okay. More warp strike, yes. Promise I'll take force next time. In my level difficulty 20 run, I got up to like level 47. I hope we're in the same pace. Okay, here comes Necromancer, who is supposed to be easy. But I'm just so bad at dodging. See what I mean? How come he popped our shield and popped this as well? Need to upgrade Divine Shield again. Okay, but at least this time we're, we're doing pretty good damage on him. We've got us dodging. Why are we moving so slow? Maris, explain yourself. Not enough shards, eh? Okay, use the pillar. Okay, he's almost done. <laughs> See, I look at my dodging. I'm dodging for no reason. Good job, Necro. Um, skeletons. Where is he? Okay, good. Yes, yes, yes. Um, soul stealers to adapt. Yes. Yes. I hope we get a, um, what is it? We gotta drop some of this stuff. I hope we get a, uh, a high level, um, Raven. Drop this. Passive XP gain. Okay. I think I'll drop, I think I'll drop this one now. Wait, I want the alteration from it, huh? only reason why I brought it. I mean, 7% to heal, yeah, but... Uh, medium... Okay. Okay, I'll do it later. Probably should do it now. Here comes more force. Oh, here comes more ward strike. <laughs> right. Okay, now... Soul Stealers are looking good. That's how I want them to look. 231 more damage, 15 minutes. I don't know. I remember I got like 600% more damage. Maybe I need ravens, huh? Oh uh, gosh, I don't know. I think we'll, we should be fine. 
until Dracula. And honestly, like, the only problem we'll have with Dracula is... Okay, we'll get... Oh, 38%. Ravens now. The only... What we'll have a problem with Dracula is the, um... The lack of mobs. Of swarms. Um... Because there's that lull, right? He'll summon a bunch of enemies, an army. Ooh! Bold. 60% more gold. Okay, fine. Um... But then, there'll be the phase wherein you're just gonna go one on one. Like, now, look at this. Us slowing down. Oh, yes! Give me fates, please. Splinter. Okay, I'll take it. Oh, we have illusion, huh? Give me splinter. And this guy. Um, more max life. Okay. Probably should have taken cooldown. 158 life. Has me believing we can take some hits. And Shrine of Krom. Okay. Uh, oh, this is spell area. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Ah, I hate these guys. Stupid homing projectiles. See what I mean? More luck. Good, more damage. Oh yeah, this thing. What is it again? Ah, armor. Why must you? Uh... Give me Celestial Wings. Why well, must you mock me? Here we go. 13% to recharge a dash. Okay. Um. Will the movement speed help with Dracula? I'm gonna look forward ahead now to this. Or is this better? The hunt awaits. Or crit chance. Yeah, we never got crit chance. 13% mm, to recharge a dash. Or just plain old movement speed. Okay, recharge a dash. Why did I take that? I don't know. The best divine shield. No rerolls, freak. Um, let me smite. Uh, yeah, smite. Are they finally dead? Stupid archers. What's next? Oh, the, uh, is this a shielded guy? Yeah, there he is. Gold dude. Okay. Stupid rock in my way. On, there you go. 16.2. Let's get that down to single digits. <laughs> Give us our best chance. Ooh, what is this? Hope it's good. Yeah, we need to clear out. Uh, minus dash cooldown movements. Ooh, that's pretty good. Actually, have a similar version, but not as good. I think I sold it. Never mind. Um, full area revival. Oh snap! Oh snap! Less XP gain. Oh, well, we're gonna switch that, man. We're gonna switch that. Someone's desperate for the first Darkness 30 win. Um, armor. Heal and level up. Expert offers. 0.4. Is that good? Spell damage. I'm dropping this. That's good. Medium. This is just for Scotty. And I think I have something good for her already. Would be good to sell, but yeah. Um, What is this again? Passive XP gain. Movement speed and evasion. Mortal Legend offers. I think I'm gonna drop this. Heal and level up. Reroll and banish. Yeah, I'm dropping that one. Okay, there's still time for Mayhem to get going here. Ravens. I mean, there's nothing else here. We're out of rerolls and stuff. Give me a magnet. I need it. <laughs> Gonna give me a karma. Did I take level two force? 
Oh, that hit us. Okay. I think I finally took level two force, right? Holy crap. Okay, okay, okay. Focus, focus here. Yes. What is this again? XP per second, enemy barriers. Okay, give me XP per second. You can still level up here. Man, two dashes is fun. Can't believe I survived with only one dash. Get moving, Maris. Give me something good time. Duration could be good. Okay, I did take level two force. Give me more duration now. I'm thinking about the uh, skeletons. That oh, what did I do? Oh. More heals. Yes, please give me enemies. Okay, no harm. So kill these archers for crying out loud. I hate you. What are you, Wondrous Ring? New skills? No. Um. Okay, we're waiting for this one. What is our damage? Sorry. Okay, uh, only 200 plus more. Oh gosh, I don't know. But pretty good summon damage though. I'll say that. Okay, this is gonna be the last wave, right? The skeleton wave. I want more divine shield. <laughs> I'm scared. More XP gain. Go. I'm gonna projectiles on this dude. Ooh, he actually got hit. This is when where force will come in handy. Should have come in handy, right? Well, we do have force. It's not like we don't have any. More luck. What is this? Rejuvenated. Warped strike for 65. 8% more damage or more summon damage? I mean, summon duration so that we get forever skeletons and they can just whack at, yeah, Dracula. That is the hope. That it that will happen. I hope curse is working right now. Okay, here we go. What is this last spot gonna be? Oh, I should have taken that later on. Okay, it's time. Please tell me I won't need a revival. Please, 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 please tell me I won't need a revival. Wait, 530. No, no, we have the. I'm confused about this whole damage thing. Yeah, yeah, it's 100% more. Got it, got it. Because we're at like 200 or something. I don't know. Okay, Ravens, let's go. Oh, man. Two dashes for the win. Okay, we're doing some pretty good early damage here. But don't be fooled. Don't be fooled. Not for one second. Do not be fooled. What is he doing? What is he doing? Okay, here we go. Let's go, skeletons. Come alive. Come alive. Come alive, skeletons. Where are they? No skeletons? Ah! Oh, pop this. Oh, shoot. Be clutch here, man. Be clutch. Ah! I just said, be clutch. Freaking idiot. I'm calling myself a freaking idiot. That's right! Ah! I'm so nervous. I'm making mistakes that I shouldn't be. Ah, like that one again. Glad lucky there. Well, I never got skeletons, huh? But I do have a parrot. <laughs> She's doing pretty good damage. Oh, that's huge attack area for you, Dracula, you jerk. Oh, we got him. <laughs> that actually ended up being an easy fight. Oh my gosh. My head is freaking pounding right now. Movement speed, pickup drops. What did we get? Oh. <laughs> I don't know what we got, but yeah. Okay. 
good first darkness 30 win and uh trying to recall now my level 20 win difficulty 20 win did i do winter or did i do lady justice i think i actually ended up doing winter so instead of like defense from divine shield and what is it blight i, I consider those defense as uh, as well as offense right because they slow down enemies chill them yeah yeah i think i did i i had to have done winter and the uh, the whole frost ring and freezing everyone thing instead of having shields but this worked out pretty well though obviously only five clear so far um i think i've yeah i don't know okay let's see our damage here the taste of time what was the taste of th the the aging thing oh that came out huge right where is it this was huge vampirism obviously where's the taste of time here here enemies age that kind of makes me feel bad that that's what gave us the most damage but it's just our first win i'll take it okay <laughs> soul stealers for the win force oh my gosh i completely underestimated force okay noted on that it did double of warp strike so it was that strong with the whole gem high and the sign of uh the time space thing my bad okay we should have been more op ravens necromancy kind of sucks it did not do a lot of damage or price did not do anything consecration okay What's gonna happen now? Is there anything that's gonna happen? Okay, that's it, huh? Oh, we just defeated, and then there's no more. We're at max, gotcha. Ah, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. So, I'll have to admit though, like I said in the beginning, the game, I don't know, it, it hasn't clicked as strongly for me until I found this build, and it pretty much, I went from like difficulty, uh, what's the first one? The first increase you can get. Here we go. So like difficulty eight. I went from difficulty eight all the way to beating difficulty 30 now on that one and only build. It just changed. Um, sometimes I take winter. Sometimes I'll take lady justice, but I have, so I'm thinking now I have five clears, right? One came from Aver no, one came from Maris, my very first win. The second one came from Averon. It was like the difficulty 8 or 14 or something win. And then the rest, all three, were from this build with Maris. <laughs> oh gosh, I gotta do different builds. And I'm concerned now how to actually pull it off because I've been so comfortable with this one now. I think that's one reason. I mean, if anyone is watching, do... Talk to me in the comments down below. I think why the game hasn't clicked as much for me is because I don't like how the main thing, the main difficulty factor, at least the way I see it for the game, is about movement speed or lack thereof. Movement speed and range, right? It's like you always have to find a solution to cover that up to cover up the um your your lack of movement speed or, or your lack of range so your lack of range maybe you'll lose summons and stuff like that or you'll just find a way to get your attack going crazy i mean that's that's good it's the movement speed thing that gets me this build was actually the first time that i was like okay okay it, it broke the game at the lower difficulties and very nice um but anyway, I don't know. This, it's not really a mini rant or anything right now. More like I want to hear what everyone has to say. Maybe I just need to play more of the game and more of the characters and explore the other stuff to get a better understanding. But I just have to give props to Maris and time and the, uh, the sign of time space and time with his gem high for allowing for this crazy build and that just ups the fun of the game by 500%. But now I guess the challenge will be find how to have fun with the other characters and with having no movement speed from uh, having a gem high <laughs> anyways enough babbling about do stay tuned and i hope that you do consider subscribing to the channel please leave a like if you enjoyed the video but anyways i'll see you guys in the next one